Hello everyone, it's Bubonic Zombie. Welcome to Just Ignore Them. Now, funny story about this game. So this game released last year and I purchased it, but it wouldn't run. It said it was a, there was a missing file or something along those lines. But recently I got it again and thankfully it's running now but also I'm on a new computer <laughs> so there's that so this game is pretty much about a child growing into an adult and his nightmares and monsters in the closet followed him throughout his life and as the title suggests his parents and everybody else is telling him just ignore it uh, so we have to deal with that this is a horror game and um, quite a few people have said, non-spoilers, but quite a few people have said that this game has a lot of glitches. But hopefully we don't encounter those, and if we do, it's not going to be anything um, truly significant to mess up the gameplay or the story. So, let's get going. And then scenes of graphic and disturbing nature as well as inappropriate language. So yeah, this is this game does have um like I said, it's a horror game, but just like the cat lady, if you guys started watching that series I did, um there there is um there are depictions of suicide, self-harm, and things like that. So trigger warning. Um but again, just like with the cat lady, this is your first and only trigger warning. You have been warned, this is a horror game. Um, there are disturbing things here. So, let's get going. Hello there. Before we start my story, I would like to go over some things first. To interact with something, use the left mouse button. Okay. Look at something. To look at something, use the right mouse button. Okay. Scroll your mouse to the top of the screen to check your inventory, access the game settings, and save the game. Okay. Oh, they have the little floppy disk to save the game. Okay. Now, back to my story. I was eight years old when it happened. But that's not to say this had happened before. Just this night was different. They would normally talk to me play with me, and sometimes sing to me. But the one thing I remember the most was their faces. Ah, It reminds me of Earthbound. Okay, so... Okay. Toys! Hey, my toy robot! Oh, his outfit looks like something from Fallout. Hmm, it's not working. It has no batteries. This should help me sleep. I should really put them away. <gasps> My spaceship! I thought I lost it! <laughs> See, Teddy! It's my creepy Teddy. <laughs> Never liked that Teddy. It moves on its own. Okay, alarm clock. It's my alarm clock. Green glow helps me sleep. Actually, for me growing up, the green glow of a light alarm clock kept me awake. Oh, it's a mouse hole. It's an old mouse hole. I haven't seen any mice since mommy hired that pest control guy. Okay. Can't do anything with it. There's the vent. It's a vent. It's too high up. I can't reach it. Maybe I can use mommy's step ladder in the kitchen. Yeah, sure. There's a monster that lives in there, too. He never really comes out. It doesn't like mommy's perfume. <laughs> That's telling. See, nothing special about it. So number of scratch into this drawer. 840. Drawer looks locked. There's the closet. There's the bed. I love watching my favorite show, Dinosaur Bus. Reminds me of the Magic School Bus. That was a cool show. Mama said I shouldn't watch TV before I go to bed. It'll give me bad dreams. Hey, people say that, but I still watch TV before I went to bed. And yeah, I did grow up with a lot of nightmares, but that's not the point. <laughs> okay. 
there's a monster that lives in there. Mommy said it's not real. I've seen it. It doesn't like my flashlight. Gonna open the closet? Oh, we can't open the closet. It's my bed in Bouncy Castle. I should probably go to bed before Mommy comes. And go to the door. I see nothing special about it. Oh, we can't go to the door either. Okay, so I think we looked at everything. Did we? I think so. I think that's everything. So, go to. Oh, whoa! <laughs> the bed moved! Okay, nice and snug. Mommy! Will you please turn off the lights? Okay, my special little guy, are you ready for bed? Yes, Mommy. Okay, honey, good night. Remember, if you see a monster, uh, just ignore it. I know, Mom. Good boy! I love you! I love you too, Mommy! Huh? I can't sleep. Well, it's only been five seconds. Oh, is this the time we get to explore? Oh! No, 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 no. I've seen how this ends. This is like poltergeist. Now, I'm gonna keep going out the door. Oh, dang it. Don't need anything else to help me. Ooh, Mom! The TV is doing that thing again! But Mom! Okay, so he's freaked out by that. Obviously. Okay, so I guess there's nothing else. You said he had a flashlight. Do you want to just go to bed? Do we just ignore it? This instance, I'm going to ignore it. I can't sleep just yet. Ah! Oh, so we can't ignore it. Is it okay. I can see something? It's a face. Oh, step away from the TV, kid. Mom! Should I turn the TV off? Yes. Where's the off button? Okay, there we go. I definitely can't sleep. Why didn't mom hear me? Oh, I just got an achievement that says they're here. That's definitely a poltergeist reference. That's what a little girl says um, when she's in front of the TV that turns on in the middle of the night. They're here. Okay. We can't go out the door. Okay. Oh, do we have to check the closet? Looks like we can't. Okay. Seven thirty PM. That's pretty early, even for an eight year old. But this has something to do with you, creepy Teddy. Why would Uncle give you to me anyway? Probably to celebrate his new job at that game company. <laughs> That's a reference to the uncle who works for a Nintendo. Which is also another horror game. Oh, what's that?
Oh, no. Oh, no. What was that? Remember what Mommy says. Just ignore them. So if we just ignore them, does that mean we can go to bed? Oh, you can't go to bed. So you want me to look in the closet, is what you're saying. Can we go out the door? No, we can't. Okay. Like Mommy said, just ignore it. Huh? Oh no! Why was there blood? Oh, was that a nightmare? I think that might have been a night. Oh, now we can go out the door. Oh, it's doing it again. So it's the same thing. Okay. Screaming for mom. Let me click no this time. Maybe I shouldn't touch the TV. Something to do with you, creepy teddy. Okay. Now let's see what happens. Just ignore them. Talk to the teddy again. Just let me go to the closet. Okay. Just close the door and find mommy. Don't look inside. Don't look inside. Okay. Now we can go outside. Okay, okay. That's what we had to do. So we're not, so we were killed the first time around because we turned on we turned off the TV. This time we turned we kept it on and we just closed the door. Okay. I was only 8 back then. I had no idea what I was in for. But nothing could prepare me for that night. Ooh. Okay, there's blood pointing to the door. Mm, I hate it when she locks the door. I need to find her spare key. Okay. Painting. I remember when Mommy got this. It was from the art museum. I still remember meeting that nice girl. I think her name was Eb. So we have to find the key. Hmm. You know, I've never really looked in here. What's this? It's a screwdriver. Mom would never let me play with this. Until now. <laughs> I use a screwdriver to play with, to open the door. Find the spare key. Okay. Linen closet. Here's something inside. Maybe I should... Huh? Are we about to get killed again? Yeah, we're dead. Oh, I didn't even notice the smiley face on the wall. Okay. So, we need to get the screwdriver. Nothing. Oh, we still have the screwdriver. Okay, office room, bathroom. It's always stuck on 3 o'clock. Oh, that's a reference <laughs> to the um, demon hour. With it, picture, picture of me and mommy. It's my first self-portrait fo photo, self-portrayed photo. That's what mommy calls it anyway. Small tear in the picture. Better not make it worse. Just 
Just a bunch of boring books. Okay, so I'm taking it because of this, we're not supposed to go in the kitchen. What's okay, there's the office. It's locked. Oh poop! Wait! There's a number scratch under the doorknob. 820. Okay, so the dresser was 840 and the office is 820. Bathroom? Why is the bathroom locked? She's in there. Why is the why would the bathroom be locked? I don't need to go. Okay. There's the lamp. Nothing special about it. Okay, I'm not gonna go in the kitchen. Telephone. It's the phone. I'm not allowed to use it unless there's an emergency. Can't do anything with it. It's kind of an emergency that, you know, <laughs> we have spooks in the house. Under spare keys. Oh, does that mean we need we need to go? To the kitchen okay we're probably about to die okay so the it's the phone machine thingy answering machine I should check the message no I'm not gonna check the message dining table it's full of dust we never use it no more since dad went missing. That is cryptic. I know he's still here between the walls. Thanks, Mom. Whoa. That is deep. Just a drawer, nothing in here, just Mommy's phone book. TV remote. That's blood. It's a bookshelf. Mommy's boring books. See what's here. No, just a strange book with red shiny thing on the side. There was one book that caught my eye. And every time I drew my hand closer, I could hear something whispering in my ear. The right code is in the full picture. What? I take it that's a hint to the different numbers we've been getting. So just um, 840 and 820. I'm not sure. Okay. Just making a quick note of those numbers. Remember in older games how you had to write down things? Let's see. Back door. That's a toaster. Oven. That is a, a bloody note. I'm not going to. There's a smiley face over that microwave. I'm not going to look in the microwave. Trash can. Trash can, yuck. But we can look at it. What's this? It's one of mov mommy's lavender smelly things. Okay, there's a note. I see nothing special about it. It's a kitchen drawer. What's inside here? Hey, it's mommy's stepladder. She needs it to reach the cupboards. So now we have the step ladder so we can go up to the vent. What's the note? It's a note from Mommy. Hi, honey. Make sure you're up early for school. Remember, your alarm clock is 10 minutes fast. I will see you in the morning. Love, Mom. Mom, jeez, I'm not a baby anymore. You haven't even hit puberty. Okay. Telephone. There's a back door. You know what? Let me check. 
the answering machine. It's a message on a telephone machine. It's mommy! This wasn't the first time I received a message from mom at late hours. Hi, honey. I'm just out grocery shopping. I found your favorite toy in the linen closet upstairs. I left it in there for you. I'll be home soon. I love you. Oh, cool. That must be my game player. That's weird. This message was recorded two minutes ago. It's too dark for mommy to be shopping. I knew who left the message. That's totally not disturbing. Okay. So, don't go to the linen closet. Drawer, TV remote, is TV remote. The TV that mommy never watches. Okay. So, hmm. there's the fear of dying, but at the same time, we need to find the key. Hmm? I can use the batteries out of this. Mommy wouldn't care anyway. She never watches TV. There was something strange about the TV in my bedroom. To turn it off, you would have to direct directly from the TV itself. But to turn it on, I had to use this remote. Did did mom turn on my TV? So we need the batteries to power up the um robot. Okay, not gonna go to that microwave. Okay, so we checked everything in here. Let's go back to the bedroom. Okay, so we can... The wall. Mommy hates it when I put her, when I put stuff up against the wall. That's an odd thing to hate your child to do. So here we have the step ladder. Okay. Okay. Vent. There's a monster lives in there too. We would need a screwdriver to get in there. Oh, he was in there. Okay. So now we know. Kitchen drawer. Not allowed in there. Mommy keeps bad things in there. Like the gun. What's in here? Nothing. Okay. Mm. Gonna be the guy, huh? Uh, maybe I should stay inside for now. Good idea. Oh, we got an achievement for that. It's called it Better Stay Inside. <laughs> Those are handprints on the back door. Okay. Try to find something else to do before I end this episode. 
Because right now I'm just clicking on everything just to see what happens. Not even worried about death happening because I'm trying to figure out what happens. Okay, same thing. Okay, so I'm going to end it here for now. Um, maybe late, uh, later on I can get back to this. I'm definitely intrigued, but with trying everything and this wasn't um, recorded. So, well, uh, pretty much I went with each and every object in my inventory and everything I can find and nothing happened so i'll get back to this sooner or later um i'm going to continue the cat lady as well as um oh sir the insult simulator but i will get back to this um as soon as i can when i find a solution all right thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you later bye